Hey, you think you are smart so answer this. Mirrors always reverse left and right, but not up and down? Why is that? Well, when the plane of the mirror is horizontal, the mirror does reverse up and down. Just think of the upside down landscape you can see in the surface of a lake. Don't be a dummy, that's not what I mean. I'm talking about a vertical mirror. Yes I knew that. Actually the simple answer is that they don't. Look in a mirror and wave your right hand. On which side of the mirror is the hand that waved? The right side, of course. But look again, mirrors do reverse in and out. Imagine holding an arrow in your hand. If you point it up, it will point up in the mirror. If you point it to the left, IT will point to the left in the mirror. But if you point it toward the mirror, it will point right back at you. In and out are reversed, not left and right. You really don't get it, do you? Look, I have a mole on the right side of my lip. However, the guy in the mirror has a mole on the left side of his lip. I wave my right hand. He waves his left hand. This happens precisely because he is facing me, and my right becomes his left. That a mirror preserves our own left, and right is trivial. But the point is, that it reverses the left and right of our reflected image. So there is this obvious question, why doesn't it also reverse top and bottom? I pat the top of my head, so does the guy in the mirror. He does not pat the soles of his feet. Perhaps the effect is due to the fact, that our eyes are aligned horizontally on our faces. So look at the mirror with one eye closed. Does it make any difference? No. I think it is gravity which is at work. Doesn't that define up and down for all? Rubbish. I lie in bed, and look in the mirror on the ceiling. The guy in the mirror is lying down. His right is my left, but the top of his head, is the top of my head. That isn't it. So what is it brain box? There is another phenomenon unrelated to mirrors, but which sheds some light, I'm in a crowd. Up and down are the same for all of us. Left and right is entirely personal. Floating in space, of course, it all becomes personal. I read once that, when astronauts go up there they get used to the idea, that their personal up is up, whatever their orientation. But when they look in the mirror, astronauts see the same thing we do, left and right are reversed, but not top and bottom. How could it be anything to do with gravity? You are not making much sense. Human beings are creatures with bilateral symmetry. We are symmetrical, our left and right halves being, more or less, mirror images through a plane defined by the vertical axis and the dorsal ventral axis, perpendicular to the mirror. Our left sides are mirror images of our right sides. Not so with top and bottom. I think this is why we have local left and right and a shared top and bottom in the mirror, as elsewhere. That's nuts. Consider the beings on the ocean planet of Skyron who are symmetrical around two axes. They are X-shaped, with four similar arms sticking out, and one eye in the center. They have a local sense of up and down as well as left and right. They look into the mirror, and see things reversed for either axes. So what about our ugly alien friends from the planet Torsor? They have no symmetry at all. Yet tell them to turn left, and they shuffle round to the left, while their mirror image shuffles round to its right. They would agree the mirror reverses left and right even though they have no symmetry. In space they lose all ideas about turning left and right. So you see, it is something to do with gravity. Perhaps, but for the case of humans I think you will find that it is symmetry which counts. I have already explained why that is wrong, loser. Are you always this stupid, or are you making a special effort today? I don't know what makes you so dumb, but it really works. Don't let your mind wander, it's far too small to be let out on its own. Loser. Bye.